Yeah. I'm Brandon. We're happy to bring you our 1,000th episode. And I'm Paul. I'm very happy to say that they've chosen the two best anchors of the past 10 years to anchor this event. Let's start with a prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United States, States of America, America and to the republic for which it stands, one, one nation, nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. International Club, we will have a meeting this coming Thursday, April 30th. If you are interested in learning about other cultures, join International Club at lunch on Thursday in Miss Bastion's room, 306. We'll be watching a movie from another culture. Seniors and scholarships, see Family Connection for details on these and other scholarship opportunities. Remember, you don't win unless you try. Are you a dependent of a currently active, retired, or deceased soldier? You may be eligible for the M.G. James Orsano Scholarship Program. <laughs> Could you write a compelling 1,000-word essay on how my family history has affected my contemporary life in San Luis Obispo County? This Friday, May 1st, is the deadline for the Stairs Kark Sedan Essay Scholarship, which will award a $3,000 and a $1,500 scholarship to the top two essays. What about equine experiences? Seniors with equine experience are encouraged to write a 500-word essay about their experiences with horses and any future interest in the equine industry to complete for the San Luis Obispo Quarter Horse Association Scholarship due May 4th. Now let's throw it over to Sports with Max. Hey guys, welcome to Sports Report. There are no sports today, but we have sports tomorrow. Golf versus Paso Robles, 2 p.m., dismissal at 12.05. Varsity Baseball versus Rigetti at 4.30, dismissal at 2.45. Volleyball versus AG, JV at 4.30, and Varsity at 5.30. And we have some track results from this weekend. Girls 4x1, Jenna, Paige, Allie, and Jacqueline play second. Girls 4x4, Allie, Jacqueline, Jenna, and Paige play second. Girls open 400, Allie placed first. Congratulations, Allie. Girls 200, Allie, Paige, and Jacqueline placed third, fourth, and fifth. Boys 100 and 200, Angel Sanchez placed first in both. Congratulations, bud. Discus, Sharif Wava placed fourth with a mark of 127 feet. Pole vault, Kyle Van Housen placed second. Now that is all. Now back to Paul Brandon. Nice job. All sophomores in Kairos, just a reminder that if you're interested in applying to be a Kairos leader for your class, you must turn in your application to the campus ministry office by 3 p.m. Tuesday. Seniors in service hours, don't forget this year is rapidly coming to a close. Please log all service hours into x 2 Vol. If you need help doing that, please stop by campus ministry office so Mrs. Burrish can walk you through it. Alpha Mother's Day flowers. Today is the deadline to let campus ministry office know if you're interested in purchasing a flower bouquet for your mother for Mother's Day. The arrangements are $12 and will be dropped off the Thursday, Friday before Mother's Day. Willy Wonka Jr., the fun and fabulous play continues its run this coming weekend. Come enjoy MCP's beautiful cast and play. I'll be there. Brandon will be there. Hopefully we see you guys there. Now let's go over to food. Hey guys, for break today we have fruit crepes, sausage egg croissants, and burritos. And for lunch we have orange chicken rice bowls, burgers with onion rings, mac and cheese, grilled cheese, corn dogs, taquitos, hamburger, cheeseburger baskets with fries and salad. That's all. Back to you guys. Good job, guys. Dramas Club presentation of Willy Wonka Jr. Friday and Saturday presentations are at 7 p.m. and Sundays at 2 p.m. Support your in-house desmians and Oompa Loompas. It's that important. Summer School. This, this is the week to sign up if you haven't done so already. Visit Summer School folder to see some options. Students must fill out a request to enroll in a non-MCP course. For each course they are considering, it must have Mrs. Chasman approval prior to registering or paying for any course. There are many steps to do when forms turn in. Meet at the deadline. Not for special report. Hello, welcome to the special report. We have a big reminder for futsal to get teams together for the futsal tournament on the 29th this Wednesday. Also, a big announcement to let everyone know that if you missed the play this past weekend, there are going to be multiple shows this weekend that you can catch. So make sure to do that. That's all for our special reporting. Now back to you. We love the play. <laughs> Prom, you have until next Monday, May 4th, to sign up for a seat on the fabled MCP prom shuttles. On Saturday, May 16th, shuttles will leave the M MCP campus at 7 p.m. Interested students must sign up with Lori in the front office. Okay, a reminder from the dean's <laughs> office. If you have a detention to serve, it must be served immediately. If you're unsure of whether or not this is about you, please see Mr. Shattuck. Remember that this is your responsibility to take care of. All detentions 
must be served before a student will be permitted to go to prom. Update on the prom announcement. The buses will leave for Harmony at 7 and return by 10.10. Sorry, that's my fault. But that's all we have for today. Wow, exciting.